watching HTN, Herrick's Television Network Sports. Happy Friday, Herrick's High School. It's your guy, Matt Bravo, back here with another sports update. There's lots of game updates, so let's get right into the show. Starting with our own, Highlander Football, which is on a winning streak and a shutout streak. Wow. They beat Westbury 26-0, and they beat Baldwin 37-0. And that defense is playing lights out. And their next game is against Uniondale, and hopefully they can pick up another victory and carry their momentum forward throughout their season. How about boys volleyball, which lost their previous game three sets to one against Syosset. Their next game is against Jericho, and hopefully they can go into that Jayhawks nest and cause some ruckus and pick up a victory so they can get back on track and have a strong season. What's girls volleyball up to? Well, they're 5-0, and and they have a game against Freeport on Tuesday, and hopefully they can keep the good times rolling and pick up a victory and keep their undefeated stretch intact. Let's talk girls swimming. Their next meet is on Saturday against Long Beach, and instead of freestyling themselves to victory, maybe I'll give them some good luck, and hopefully they can backstroke themselves to victory this time. What's girls soccer up to? Well, they had a tough loss against Port Washington by a score of 4-1. to Their next game is on Tuesday against Hicksville, and hopefully they can get some revenge against those Comets since they lost to them earlier in the season. How about boys soccer, which is hopefully back into shape and is ready for their upcoming games. But we have a little twist. The JV boys soccer team won their game on Monday, April 5th, with a score of 3-2 against Freeport. Two goals were scored by Mark Serini and one by Asim Ibrahim. Defensive standouts in the game were given by Christos Kateas, Manny Tahas, and goalie Aiden Badzim. What about boys badminton? Well, they have a game on Monday against Manhasset, and hopefully they can birdie themselves to victory and keep their momentum going in the right direction. Let's talk boys golf, which has had an average season so far, and hopefully they can keep themselves prepared and get some momentum going to the final stretch of the season. Last but not least, we're on to girls tennis, which had a great win against Plainview JFK by a score of 5-2. to two. Hopefully, they can keep up this momentum for their upcoming games in the near future. This is the end of your sports update. My name is Matt Bravo. Next time I'll be here, you'll have some more game updates and score updates. Stay tuned. And remember, Herricks, stay safe and stay classy. Thank you for watching HTN Sports.